So today I'm going to sort of have a pickleball paddle review. This is more of a first impressions. My friend let me play with his 6-0 double black diamond last night. And I wanted to kind of give you an initial reaction on how I thought it played and give you some thoughts on the type of player that I think this paddle is for. So the very first thing that I noticed is when I got it in my hand was that it felt a lot lighter than my Vatic Pro. And the amazing thing is, is that I think it's about the same weight, but because the weight is so close to the handle, the paddle has a very low swing weight. And that let me, uh, in the game that I was playing, my hands were pretty fast at the kitchen line. And I didn't feel like I was swinging like an 8.2 ounce paddle. I thought maybe he had put lead tape on it towards, towards the throat. And that wasn't the case at all. It felt very light in the hand, despite the fact that it weighed as much, if not more, than my Vatic Pro. One of the things that I noticed immediately, too, as I was hitting the ball and dinking and doing resets is that this paddle has a huge sweet spot. I was really impressed with the size of the sweet spot and how forgiving the paddle is because you know, you, you get some paddles and you play with them and they have a very small sweet spot. They're not very forgiving and the paddle's going to twist in your hand like crazy. Now this paddle did twist a bit in my hand, but nothing like some of the more lightweight paddles that I've played with that are in the 7.8, 7.7 ounce range. The 6-0 double black diamond has a lot of pop and a lot of power. I was really impressed with the amount of power that I could get in it and how the ball came off the face of the paddle. But it didn't really suffer too much in the control area. Once I got it dialed in in the game, I was able to control my dinks and to control my resets. And I think that just comes from my personal experience of playing with a paddle that isn't necessarily as forgiving as this one. And so I was able to dial that in fairly quickly. I did have some high dinks and some thirds, but eventually I got that dialed in and my partner and I at the time, uh, we won our game. Another thing that I noticed about this paddle is that it, I could generate a lot of spin with this. Even though the person who loaned me his paddle had been playing with it for months now, uh, the surface was still able to generate the spin that I expected. Uh, I had the pop and the power that I expected from it. The sweet spot was still large. And uh, I just, it was just, I had a great time playing with this paddle. Let's just say that. So who is this paddle for? Well, it's probably not going to be for a beginner. I think there's too much pop and too much power on this paddle for a beginner to play with unless they have some kind of background in a racket sport where they're used to being able to control their grip and their swing. I think obviously intermediate to advanced players will be able to take advantage of this paddle and clearly it's fairly durable. Um, the guy that I play with, um, he wails on that thing and so uh, it, and it's still seems to perform like a brand new path. All right, so that's my initial reaction to the 6-0 Double Black Diamond. Uh, I really appreciate my friend uh, for letting me play with it. Sorry I don't have any footage of me playing with it. You might be seeing some footage of him playing with it here in this video. You might have seen that. 6-0, uh, if you want to send me a paddle to review, uh, I'd love it. My contact information is on the About page. Uh, until next time, I'm John, your Gen X grandpa. Keep dinking.